What's up everybody, it's Ed here, but before we get started, let's play a little game. Can you guys guess what anime this song is from? So here's a quick clue before the review. I would think back to 2008 or 2009, and you would probably maybe not recall this one, because this one is a like... I don't really want to call it, it's like a zombie demon anime, if that gives you any clue. But, <laughs> with that being said, let's start the show. What's up everybody? Yo, what's up everybody, Zed here, and today I'm doing an anime review on Fruit Basket. Man, this one brings me back. Like, you guys don't even know. I remember watching this one when I was a kid. And uh, it was funny, man. When I was younger, I was super, super close minded with animes. Like, I liked one genre, or, well, two genres, and that's it, man. Anything else, fuck that. So, needless to say, like, chick flicks with no real powers or this or that, like, I'd never really watched until I met this one chick. And so, long story short, we made an agreement. She'll watch one of my animes if we watch one of hers. And this one, not this one because it came out in 2019, but the older version of this one was the one. And honestly, I wanted to hate it. I wanted to hate it so badly. But I just, I couldn't. But... <laughs> Let me explain what this anime is about before I start kicking it over to my thoughts. I did this a little bit backwards, so let's back this up. Fruit Basket, what is that? <laughs> Sorry about that. Fruit Basket is about the zodiac signs, and they actually, they exist. Like, there's people who, you know, a cat, a rat, blah, blah, blah. And the problem is, they all have a quirk. Work, cork, whatever. They all have a condition where if the opposite sex touches them, like a, like a hug, they revert back into their zodiac animal. And uh, honestly, man, it's crazy how much the characters really resemble. Oh, I forgot to say, their characters really resemble their sign. So as you're watching it, you can kind of play along and try to figure out uh, what, uh, what they would be. But... <laughs> Basically, that's it, man. Let's just go kick it over to my thoughts where I'll go uh, a, a lot, a lot deeper. <laughs> so, in this one, man, like I was saying earlier, I was just so against chick flicks. And I remember when I first watched the original, I was... I was so against it, but honestly, I fell in love with it. I was like, man, even though I only like like magic and things with powers or swords, those are my two things, like magical or swords, or both if I was lucky. That would be badass. I mean, of course, and then demons and shit, right? But uh, that was basically it. And then this one was literally the first anime that broke me out of my cycle, like completely broke me out of the cycle. That I actually really loved. Like I was like, man, I was so emotionally attached to to everything, and it was so sad that it ended. And the first thing I said to her, I was like, so we're gonna watch season two, and she's like, there is no season two. You have to read the manga. And the thing is, I don't read, so that sucked for me because I never got to know the rest of the story. And then I also heard that um, that one didn't do a really good job portraying the manga. As again, like I said, I've never read the manga. So when I found out that they're remaking Fruit Basket, I was like, no fucking way. And let me tell you, like I just finished it and it was still as good as I remember it. And honestly, <clears throat> Looking at uh, the side by sides, you can totally tell, you know, which one's the newer. Like, they definitely did it. And if my source is correct, they're going to actually be telling the whole story. 
like season one's just finished so you can literally go binge watch that which i did i love it it was fucking amazing the only problem is there's not more but like i was saying earlier for my sources they're confirmed making all of them like from start to end like they're going to make the complete series and if that source is correct and if, if people can confirm it that would be really fucking amazing because if they do man i am so hyped i am so hyped literally i'm gonna be so pissed off if i just rewatched season one got hyped again and if they do not finish like that's literally going to like just oh <laughs> like there's so many on that shelf that should have been finished but never I don't want to add free basket to it. Not again. Like I did in the past. They stirred up my feelings. But they, I hope to God they finish it. So needless to say guys. If you have not watched it. I would definitely. Definitely check it out. Because uh, I mean. Even if you're not really into. The chick flick style. I didn't even really tell too much about it. I'm sorry. So long story short. It's, um, it's about this girl. And the Zodiac family. And um, I don't really want to tell too much about it, honestly, because it was fun to watch and learn. Honestly, if you guys are just into, if you're wanting to see like a, a nice, cute story that um, has a nice pace, it's not too fast, it's not too slow, music is done well, um, and you just, they develop the characters so so well like you you watch the characters develop and honestly it's all of that and it's the good story like is what really makes it so i mean if it was good enough to take me when i was a kid like not into anything remotely like this and and get me to like this genre like I, honestly this is probably the only one i've watched in the genre but i don't know what the fuck genre this is i guess the chick flick genre because i don't really watch too many of those but this one, man, this one is definitely, definitely, it was, I don't know, it was really good, <laughs> in my opinion. But, you guys, you know what, that's just my thoughts. Uh, let me know down in the comments, for those who have seen this anime, let me know how you guys liked it. And, you know, or, you know, whatever. <laughs> but, let me know your thought. I guess I should have said, let me know, let me know your guys' thoughts about this anime down in the comments and would you or would you not recommend this anime hey guys if you really enjoyed my content please head over to my profile and if you haven't already click on that sub button but then also click on that little bell that bell will notify you anytime i post up a video so that way you can always be kept up to date Thank you guys for watching. I had a lot of fun making this video. Uh, don't forget to check out my description. A lot of shit's there. I'm also a part of the Brave program. So if you want to help support me but you don't have any money, that's perfectly fine because I'm not asking for money. But it does help me, you know, get food on the on the plates. And, but... <sighs> Thank you guys for watching. I had a lot of fun making this video. Uh, don't forget to check out my description. There's a lot of shit in there. Also, if you want to help support me, I'm a part of the Brave program. If you guys don't know what that is, I have a link in the uh, description and it talks all about that. It's a nice little five minute video. Uh, that actually helps me out tremendously. So, uh, other than that, guys, I will see you in the next one.